Hello. You may remember me from Saturday scene. My name is Mary. And as we're not able to meet at the moment, we thought you might enjoy a story. The story you will hear is from the Children of God Storybook Bible by Archbishop Desmond Tutu. It is being read and the pictures shown with the kind permission of the publishers, Colin Harper Collins. I should also like to thank Georgina for her help. The story I am going to read is about Moses and the story is in four parts. Here is part one and it is called Moses is Saved. It is taken from the Bible, Exodus chapter 2. Miriam watched her mother place her baby brother into a basket floating on the river. Miriam looked round nervously for soldiers. It had been many years since Joseph and his brothers had died. Now a wicked pharaoh ruled Egypt. He had forced Joseph's descendants, called the Hebrews, into slavery and ordered every baby Hebrew boy to be killed. Miriam's mother cried as she pushed the basket into the reeds. Watch over him, she said. Miriam quietly followed the basket as it floated down the river. Her baby brother began to cry. Miriam gasped as she saw one of Pharaoh's daughters coming to bathe in the river. Would Pharaoh's daughter turn the baby over to the soldiers? Pharaoh's daughter picked the baby up and rocked him gently in her arms. Poor little thing, this must be one of the Hebrew babies, she whispered. He needs a mother. Miriam came out from behind the reeds and said, I know a Hebrew woman who can nurse the baby for you. Pharaoh's daughter gave the baby back to his own mother and said, When he is old enough, bring him to the palace so I can raise him as a prince. I will name him Moses since I drew him out of the water. This is the end of part one of our story and we will just finish with a short prayer. Dear God, thank you for loving and protecting your children. And we all say, Amen.